with our handprints and our footprints. So what you will need is your craft four from your camp box. In your craft four bag, you will see construction paper, a white piece of paper, a googly eye, and a piece of twine string. So from home, you will need paint, paint brushes, glue, and paper towel or napkins, because it's gonna get messy. Place the white paper on the floor. Paint your foot the color you would like the toucan's body to be. Place your foot on the paper and take it off once there is a good footprint. So next, it's time for you to make your feathers. So what you're gonna do is now you're gonna paint your hand. So I'm going to choose orange for the first color. So make sure you have the majority of your palm of your hand covered with paint. And now you're ready to paint the feathers. So what you want to do is you want to be still connected to the body, but you want to put it outwards. It'll look like this. Now I'm going to repeat this step with two other colors to add lots of pretty feathers. When you're done, it should look something like this. Now you can set it aside to give it a bit to dry. And now you can work on your leaves and the toucan's beak. So you can take a marker or pencil and uh, trace out the shape before you cut it out. The beak should look something like this. And you can draw leaves, so just like ovals or circles, and when you cut them out, they should look like leaves. So now that you have all your pieces cut out, you can add some black marker for details on your leaf if you'd like to. And now you're ready to glue everything on. So first, take your googly eye, and you wanna put it on the heel of your foot, so at the top of your bird. Next, take the beak and put some glue on it. And you want to attach it right beside the eye, coming out from the heel. Next, take your twine. This is going to be the branch that the toucan is going to rest on. So once you see it on the page, if you need to cut it a bit, you can. And adjust where you would like it to be. I think it looks good right there, so I'm going to take some glue and put it on the twine. Now you're ready to add your leaves along the branch. When you're done, it should look something like this. Thanks for joining. See you next time.